fatty fatters. Oh my god, I love these steaks. Look, rusty shed today. Booyah. Hell yeah, today's gonna be pretty cool. Oh, we gotta change out his water. Cages are dirty. We got some stuff to do here today. What is up, guys? How the hell are you? Welcome to the show. My name is Tyler. A lot of people have been asking how much do these rattlesnakes weigh, okay? And I honestly don't know. I think that they're what, 20, 25, 30 pounds, maybe? That's what I think the male is, at least. The female, she's pretty heavy too. I don't know how much she is either. So I thought that it would be a good idea to, let's figure it out. We're gonna weigh them today so we can just solve that question for everybody asking, because literally, dude, so probably 50 people at least have sent me messages asking how much these snakes weigh. And we don't know. And it's not something that I could just throw on the gram scale like I do with everything else. The kilo, I'm just kidding. But uh, yeah, we're gonna use a regular scale today. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go weigh myself on the scale in the bathroom, hold one of the rattlesnakes, go in there with the rattlesnake, weigh myself with him, do the math, and we'll figure it out that way. And then, towards the end of the video, Rusty, you can see my little dude, Look, he gets prettier and prettier every time he sheds. Like, look at that orange light coloration on him. It's crazy, when I first got him, you could see he had bands on his body a lot more uh, prominent than he does now. They're honestly like kind of going away. He doesn't really have too much of a pattern anymore. He's kind of just getting more lighter in coloration and losing that pattern. But he had a great shed. Looks like it's pretty much just in one piece. He likes to mess it up a little tiny bit. Oh, you're so curious, dude. Such a curious little cobra, man. He just always wants to know, like, what is up, what is going on. Hey, man, are you hungry? I'm going to feed you right now. So he shed last night. So today we're going to feed him. But first, let's get these rattlesnakes out of the cage and uh, see how much they weigh. We'll settle this settle this debate right now, okay? Let me go. Uh, I'm going to go weigh myself first and see how much that is. Dang, 157. Holy crap. I weigh nothing. I need to get my ass back in the gym, man. Oh. Alright, let's see who we should do first. We should do the female first, because she's probably not going to weigh as much as the male. We'll leave the male for the grand finale. You want to pass me that hook right there? Let's see her. Robin, I'm sorry to show everybody your weight. I know girls are very sensitive about it. But uh, we're, that's what we're doing today, sweetheart. So let's see what we got going on here. Now, I just want to carefully get these out just like this. Grab her like that. Make her feel nice and secure. Alrighty. I know, baby. I know, it's okay. It's okay, it's okay. So let's go into the bathroom very carefully. We want to close that cage, Alex. See what we got here. 166. Dang. She's only nine pounds. That's not bad at all. Not bad at all. Like uh, I was saying in a previous video, I'm gonna be putting these snakes on a diet. Not so much her, cause she's not really overweight. She's totally healthy. She's a great, great body weight. Look at that. No obesity to this snake really at all, which is great. So, I want to keep my snakes nice and super healthy. So I definitely do not want them getting fatty liver disease and dying too young, okay? I want to keep these guys as long as possible, and I want them to live a nice, long, healthy life. So, let's put Robin, whew, what a beautiful freaking snake, man. Look, I'm holding her like a baby. All right, let's put her back in the cage. Let's go, um, yeah, I'm gonna go that side. So that way it's a little bit easier to get Batman out the other one. So let's go ahead, put Robin back here. So now, now that I know that Robin is nine pounds, it kind of gives me more of an idea for Batman. Batman, I'm guessing if Robin's nine pounds, Got to say 20? Yeah, 20? He's twice as thick. Twice as thick? And a little longer. Yeah? 
All right, let's see. Yeah, I guess he is probably about twice. Yeah, so I'm saying, I'm saying like 16 to 20. Just that's that's gonna be 15 mine. 15 is a more reasonable guess, but I, I want 15 to be Yeah, I'm saying 16 to 20. 15 sounds maybe reasonable, but yeah, 16 to 20. Let's see here. All right, Batman. All right, big boy. Let's see here. He's not morbidly fat either. He's a good size rattlesnake, you know? But I just want to make sure this guy stays super healthy and doesn't have any problems down the road. So, let's try to more securely grab him real fast. I'm gonna try to do this as safe as possible, all right? So let's slowly creep back into the bathroom. Like this. He's like, yo, what are you doing with me, Dad? All right, so let's see. Boom. Holy crap. 173. Boom. All right, so he's 16 pounds. That's just what I said. I said 16 to 20, right? You did. So I was right. What a cool freaking snake. So 16 pounds, man. I mean, yeah, that's, that's pretty big for a rattlesnake. But honestly, it's not too shabby. I thought that he was gonna be, I said 16 to 20, now that we raid, we weighed uh, Robin. But at first we were like, oh dude, this snake's gotta be like 25, 30 pounds, which is a lot for a freaking snake. But dude, as you can see, he is awesome. Super great temperament. He just wants to hang out and chill. Nothing cooler than a big ass tame rattlesnake, man. That's why I got these guys. Obviously, I love my Cobras, I got a lot of them, but to me, there's nothing more impressive than a big, big puppy dog tame rattlesnake. I gotta stop saying puppy dog tame, because puppies bite, you know what I mean? Puppies bite all the time, actually. So, we need to come up with another, we need to come up with another, uh, Shiva tame. Yeah, Shiva tame. My dog will never bite you. Actually, that's not even true either, because if my dog doesn't know you and you come to my house, She's f***ing you up. Oh, all right, Batman, let's get you back in your cage. Oh, you big, beautiful boy. I'm gonna feed, I'm gonna feed Robin probably in the next couple days here. We got some more videos to make. I'll probably do an update on Kilo. Uh, hopefully this coming week, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do that. Kilo's been doing great. He's already done with all of his medication. So now I'm just letting that finalize through. Uh, I was talking to my buddy Don yesterday. He's giving me some tips about how to convert Kilo over from eating chicks to eating rats. So we're gonna make a video doing that next week and hopefully he eats rat. Fingers, fingers crossed. It's really Fingers crossed. I can't cross these fingers. I'm gonna cross these fingers. Fingers crossed. Hopefully he eats. But you know who always eats and who's always hungry and who's always in the mood? Mr. Rusty right here. So first things first, we gotta clean out his cage. He's got little spicy meatballs all over the place. He's got a dirty water bowl and he's got shed in the cage. So let's go ahead. Let's take Rusty out. See how big he's getting. Alex, clean his cage and then Let's give him a Burmese python little treat. All right, let's go. All right, Russ. Come on. Yeah, look how thick he's getting. Much thicker. Look at this guy. And you can see his colors way better when he's out of his cage. No, 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 no. Don't go that way. Come here, crazy snake. Look at this. Yeah, dude, look how much bigger he's getting. Wow. Definitely way bigger. Come on, careful there, boy. Get you in the garbage can. He's so agile. Oh, look, he's still got some. Oh, let's help him out here. He's still got a little bit of stuck shed on his tail. Just help pull that off a little bit. No? Oh, Jesus. Woo. Russ. <laughs> For real. <laughs> it's crazy. They're arboreal snakes, so you can see how fast he could just lift his whole body up and just dart right out the freaking trash can. King Cobras are so agile, man. Strong, agile snakes, dude. You gotta watch out. Woo! Look how clean that freaking cage is, man. Alex, killed it. 
I'm gonna spray it down. Get that humidity up for my little dude, because he likes it. Man, the cage looks great. Nice and clean. That's the way I like it. Nice, nice, nice. All right, let's put Russ back and then feed him. All right, Russell, little Russ. Yeah, dude, he's definitely getting bigger. Getting bigger. He's so fast and on point with everything, too. Like, but look at the light coloration of him. He's getting really pretty, man. Awesome Cobra. Awesome, awesome. Now hopefully the bigger he gets, the more he'll get used to me and the more he'll try to chill out a little bit and he won't try to murk me all the time. Apparently he's a full Malaysian. But we will see. Only time will tell. So they're supposed to get lighter and lighter as older as they get. Look, I have food for you. Come on, look. He smells it. Look that tongue flick. He's like, mm, I smell it. Gotta come over here, look. Look over here. Come on, man. Boom. Headshots every time. Look, he's like, what the hell? Come on, pull it up in your cage. Is that too heavy for you? Let me help him out a little bit. Boom. There we go. What a great eater. So good to have a king that has an appetite now. Never gives me any problems eating anything. He's been eating, I'm pretty sure, probably every 10 days he's been getting a berm. So, at that rate, he should get big pretty quick. So let's close this glass and let him do his thing for a little bit. Slurps that freaking thing down. Ooh. Dude. Killer. Oh, that was delicious for you. God, he's such a pretty cobra. Like, look how handsome his little face is. You're a handsome little cobra, dude. I love it. His eyes and his nose and his... Oh, God, you're just so cute. Oh, sorry. Boom. All right. That's that. So, I hope we answered some questions for you guys. Everybody was asking. Everybody was asking, how much do they weigh? Now you know. Robin, nine pounds. Kilo, or freaking Batman. Batman weighs 16 pounds. Not bad. She's got great weight. He's a little on the overweight side. He's honestly still not that bad. So, like I said before, every eight weeks I'm gonna be feeding them. Probably gonna bump both of them down to jumbo rats. Well, Robin's eating jumbos. I'm bumping him down to jumbos. Um, so that's it, man. Stay tuned. Kilo's up next. We're gonna try to feed Kilo a rat. And uh, we're just gonna do a general update of the whole room. Show you how the ring calls are doing. Show you how all the other stuff is doing. All the arboreal stuff. It'll be sweet. Make sure, guys, if you are not subscribed to this channel, go hit that subscribe button. Make sure you like this video. Leave a comment, even if it's just saying what's up. Everything, likes, comments, that all helps the video grow, helps exposure get out there. Go do it. Help me out. Help you out. You know what I mean? So, till next time, peace out, guys. Love you. Later. Bye.